Welcome to Ancestry Academy. I'm Laura Prescott. Today we're going to talk about a new feature on Ancestry.com, DNA Circles. So we've invited Dr. Ross Curtis to come in today and speak to us a little bit more about how to understand your circles. Welcome to Ancestry Academy, Ross. Oh, thank you. I'm excited to have you here because I'm really ignorant about DNA circles, and I imagine a lot of our viewers don't know much about them since they're so new. What are you going to be talking about? Well, first I want to talk about where they are on the website, mm -hmm. and then, then I'll talk about the biology behind DNA circles, why we can even create them. And then we'll dive into how they're created, how they add ev evidence to your research, and then we'll look at how to use them. And that's my favorite part of the course is how can we use these DNA circles to, to create more discoveries about our family history. And that's what I think a lot of people want to use those for. So that will be interesting too. And you are what part of Ancestry? What do you work with? I'm, I'm on the Ancestry DNA science team. The science team. So that's uh, your PhD was in? In computational biology. So you know your stuff, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I, I think so. <laughs> well, welcome. Let's get to it. And Let's learn something new about your genealogy and how it fits into DNA circles at Ancestry. <laughs> 